It looks like a hostile carrier has landed in your mining belt, and you're nowhere near done with your industrial cycle. There's a multitude of reasons this could happen, from not keeping an eye on intel, to a lucky wormhole group rage rolling into your system. Either way, you're tackled, and now you have to survive long enough for help to arrive. With the help of a few pilots and a magical thing called the contact list, the Brave Collective is going to teach you how to do just that. It looks like quite a few pilots are landing. Four carriers, a rattlesnake, and a dreaded heavy interdiction cruiser. This may look bad, but a properly fitted vehicle has one of the most powerful active tanks of any ship in EVE, so you can likely brush this aside and wait until they decide to run off or some of your friends come along and kill them. For the sake of education though, let's assume either a more powerful force is on field or you did something stupid like forget your gap boosters. Your tank is breaking, but you're a goof oracle who decided to fit a panic module, so you're going to lock up the nearest rock and activate that thing. You're now invulnerable for 5 to 7.5 minutes, plenty of time for your friends to form a nice large fleet to come and save your ass. Oh no! It looks like the enemy has seen through your cunning plan and put up a mobile cyno inhibitor to stop your friends from being able to reach you. That's alright, because that baby has a 2 minute online timer, during which you can let your cyno and still have it remain active even if it does fully online. Your fleet now has 10 minutes to jump to you, and whether the enemy runs away or escalates, what happens next is out of your hands. What you can be assured of though is that you haven't been made into a meme by dying in a vertical without using your panic or letting your cyno. Congratulations! Thank you.